you have a car there. Oh. Rainbow traffic, we're 83993, take off runway 27, remain in the pattern for anyone. Everybody's busy to get out of Brandywine here before the TFR. <laughs> yep. Looks like we're number four for takeoff. Busy morning. Yeah. Yep. Is that that guy? Yeah. Uh, Brandywine traffic, uh, the Bonanza on the taxiway, are you doing a run up? I firm uh, we're still waiting for oil temper to come up. Okay, I'm just gonna uh, scoot around you for a minute. He's scooting around. Brandywine traffic, we're E3993, we're entering the 45 degree entry to the downwind for runway 27, Brandywine. Brandywine traffic, Bonanza 678, straight reporting runway 27, and via okay. port departure to the north, Brandywine. And for anyone traffic, now we'll be turning left downwind for 27 for anyone. Uh, Brady one traffic, uh, left for one power box, hold short 27 for uh, landing traffic. Right. American 1998 traffic, right. 2 to 3 o'clock, 1 mile northeast bound to Skyhawk at 7,500. American 1998 looking. How's it looking? Yeah, it's looking good. How's the wind situation? Yeah, that's not good. Strong headwinds there and no winds on the way back. Oh. I feel we're rarely lucky with the wind. <laughs> Just from a probability perspective, it is much more common to have a headwind than a tailwind. Because if you have a wind that comes straight from the side, it's not like, you know, you're going to have to go into it to stay on course. So that becomes a headwind. Yes, I'm just saying, we have a lot more headwind than tailwind. Yes, most pilots feel that way. Well, I'm a passenger. I feel that way. Allen Town Approach, Bonanza 6267 X-Ray. Bonanza 6267 X-Ray, Allen Town Approach, IDENT, altimeter 3009er. 009er and IDENT, 67 X-Ray. And 67 uh, X-Ray, say intention. Yeah, 67 X-Ray, leveling 7500, request flight following to 1 India 1, and we're a Bravo Echo 35. And Bonanza 67 X-Ray, you're about uh, 6 miles outside of my airspace still, I have a code for you then. 67 X-Ray, roger. Bonanza 6267 X ray, squawk 3316. 3316, 67 X ray. Bonanza 67 X ray, radar contact 14 miles south of Allentown Airport, proceed on course, advise prior to altitude change. 67 X ray, welcome. Boo! Boo! Guard morons. Yeah. Morons everywhere, I guess. Yeah, can't get rid of them. Not even up here. No, not even in the air. I mean, this is a cool part if you look at it with the river and the yeah. mountains. That's the Delaware Water Gap. The Delaware Water Gap. 6-7 X-ray, Boston Center, 134.3, good day. 34.3, good day, 6-7 X-ray. Boston Center, Bonanza, 6-2, 6-7 X-ray, 7,500. Altimeter 6267 X ray Boston Center, the Stewart Altimeter 3003. 003. There's a great Sakandaga Lake. Have you heard about that? The great Sakandaga Lake. 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 Sakandaga Sakandaga I'm sure we don't have it right. Yeah, Mary 958, Santa 1, 3,000 for uh, Bowen at 1, 1, 11, We've got Lima. Closer. Jet 929, Boston. Yep. Roger. And I'm seeing more color. Yeah. Particularly on your side, I feel like. 
Uh, I think it's the sun it's also, the sun. like, you yeah, know. Yeah, there's definitely some nice color. Yeah. From the one point of It's not peaking, but it's, uh... And, uh, let's see, Present. one false up yeah. here. 3000. Number 32816, you got Lake Placid in sight, 12 o'clock, 12 to 1 o'clock, 10 zero miles. Yeah, negative yet, 32816. Roger. Number 6267 six, X-ray, traffic at your 11 o'clock, 2 miles, primary target only, type, type an altitude unknown. Uh, it just popped up, not sure if anything. 67 uh, X-ray, we'll be looking. The launch, uh, eight, six miles west of, uh, Marcy Field there. No other traffic to Squawk BFR and have a nice day. You as well, 6 on extra, thank you. Just like Washington State. Caution, terrain, terrain. Caution, terrain, terrain. Warning, terrain, terrain. Caution, terrain, terrain. Marcy Field traffic, Bonanza 6, 7, X-ray, as 5 miles to the south. We'll be uh, doing a low approach, runway 2, Marcy Field. Marcy Field, Bonanza 6, 2, 6, 7, X-ray, is on a 2 mile final, runway 2, Marcy Field, to be a low approach. Marcy Field, Bonanza 6, 2, 6, 7, X-ray, short final, runway 2, low approach, Marcy Field. So 6267 X-rays, uh, left base, runway 2, Morse Field. Warning, terrain, terrain. That was fun. I do think so. I decided maybe I'm too old for such adventures myself. I much prefer to take off that direction. Because that was sketchy. But you don't think that would be? I think it would be less sketchy. You see there's like a hill coming up there yes. with like really tall yes, trees. Yes, I saw the hill. So yeah, I think I much prefer taking off that direction. Let's go hiking. Now the wind really is blowing down that way. I thought we were taking off this way. Yeah, but look at the wind. Wind matters more. You have a car there. Uh. So six, seven, X-ray is uh, left Terrain. crosswind. Runway two, Marsfield. That was the right decision. Yeah, glad we made it up. The wind matters so much because that's three, four extra knots. 
which I yeah. have in my favor, versus getting three, four knots in my to my disadvantage. Right, which so is like actually. What, and, and when you're when you're speeding down the runway and you're going at like sixty knots trying to get off the ground, it's a huge difference, right? There was like one small bump on the runway, and I was like, ooh. It's beautiful here, though. Caution, terrain. Caution. Yeah, super beautiful. I think that car was taken by surprise. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they were smart, though, and they stopped. Yeah. They didn't try to go behind you. I mean, I wasn't going to not use that little bit of road. Boston Center, number 6267X-Ray. Number 6 x yeah, 6267 extra. We're approximately 11 miles south of Lake Placid, passing through 7,200. We're looking for an IFR to Oscar, Quebec, November. And 67 extra, did you have an IFR on file? Uh, IFR, we filed it about 20 minutes ago. Okay. Number 67 extra, it's block 343, three, 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 four. Uh, 3534. 3534 for 67 extra. Air Canada 099 cross F.at maintain 1000, deal similar 200, 800. Number 67 x radar contact 88 miles south of Lake Placid at 8,000. Include to Oscar Quebec, November Airport, via S files, maintain 8,000. Oscar Quebec, November uh, at 8,000, S files, 6 on Well, that was a fun takeoff. Because we made it. <laughs> well, I mean. What do you do if you get to the end of the runway? Like right about midfield, you got to make a decision. Like, okay, if you think if you don't think you're going to make it, then you. Pull the throttle off of an six a with you would slam the brakes. So you have to know where midpoint is and where you yeah. need to be by then. Yeah. VX is the best climb speed, and VX is 77 knots in this plane, fully loaded with flaps up. And we had one notch of flaps in, which on most planes you actually shouldn't do because it hurts you. But on this plane, it helps you not a ton. If you're at sea level, or more or less sea level, we were at 1,000 feet now, but if you're at density altitude, it definitely helps to have the flaps in. So I always have one notch of flaps in, almost always, just so I'm used to how the plane yeah. handles with one notch of flaps in. So with flaps in, VX is going to come down, so it's going to be lower than 77. So you probably gain about four or five knots with one notch of flaps in VX, which also means that the plane is slower and when the plane is slower, you're eating less ground to get the plane up. And we're also not fully loaded, and that case gives you a few knots, too. And then what, what height were we at at midfield? Because it felt like we were like 10 feet off the ground for a little bit. Yeah, and you want to be, because that, that when you're like that 10 feet above the ground, you're in ground effect. So it helps you. You can fly slower. So you want to get off the ground because it's a soft field, and because it's a soft field, it's going to slow you down a little bit because it doesn't roll as nicely as on the tarmac. Yeah. So when it's a short, soft field, you want to do something in between a short field takeoff where you just, like, hammer down as fast as you can, no nose up, go as fast until you reach the point of the VX speed, and then you basically just pull it up and Which go like a rocket. Which like, yeah. out in Washington State. Right. And that's, like, Ranger Creek, that's what you would yeah. do. But this is a short, soft field, so now you can't do that fully because you want to keep the nose wheel up a little bit because when you do hit those bumps, right, you don't want, like, the nose wheel to be damaged or the nose to dip and the prop to hit. So you want to have the nose a little bit up, which means you're gonna, the plane's going to try to come off the ground, like, as soon as it can, and then it's going to be in that ground effect, which is almost like a, it's like a cushion that yeah. you're in for a bit until you get to that speed where the plane really flies. And you keep it there until you're at VX, and then when you're at VX you go for it. And in this case, you go for it, and you had to tilt a little bit, and you need but to be... But how high up were we when we started to tilt? Not, not very high. Yeah, that's yeah. what I thought. Yeah, but, but I, I mean, I did it on purpose, because you're, you're in that ground effect, you keep it in ground effect until you're at VX. As soon as I was at VX, I started coming up and coming right at the same time. Yeah. Because I didn't want to lose any more ground, because if I, if I went too far and I had to make too steep of a turn, that gets really dangerous, because... If you have to do yeah, steep yeah, turns yeah. when you're that slow, that's how people, you know, get a stall yeah, spin accident at low altitude, and it's yeah. not good. Well, it's very bad, actually.
Number 67 X ray contact, Syracuse approach 127.42. 2742 for 67 X ray. What were they called? Don't know. Sorry. I was half reading and heard her. I heard 2742. Number 67 X ray contact, Syracuse approach 127.42. Syracuse. Is that what she said? Syracuse. Syracuse approach, Bonanza 6267 X-ray 8000. Bonanza 6267 X-ray, Syracuse approach, Jeff Moon, from Griffith, Delta, Niner, Niner 5. Niner, Niner 5, 67 X-ray. It was Niner, Niner something. <laughs> uh, let's take 5, it's in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I think I could have heard 5. 467 X ray traffic, uh, 2 to 3 o'clock in 5 miles southwest bound, or southeast bound, let's say, Cessna 421, BFR 8500. Boston Center 67 X has got the traffic. Roger. 467 X ray traffic, 12 o'clock in 7 miles out of the direction of Bonanza 9000. A Bonanza? We'll be looking out for the other Bonanza 67 X ray. He's above us. Oh, there he is. That's, I mean,. Is he going that fast? He's no, a it's a jet plane. I'm joking. I know. I was like, no. <laughs> what? <laughs> Trickster. That's a bonanza with like a rocket jet, jet attached jet to it. Well, I there he is. I don't six seven X just got the traffic. Wilkesbury approach bonanza six two six seven X ray eight thousand. Bonanza 6267 X-ray will clear approach. We'll clear out submitter 2993. Good evening. And a minute to reach five up. Okay, 993 and uh, standby 67 X-ray. Is that what he said? An amended route? Yeah. I did not I mean, understand. Like, <laughs> and go ahead for 67 X-ray. Remember 67 X-ray clear to OQN via direct East Texas VOR. At Echo Tango X-ray. Victor 29 to Pottstown VOR, then direct. Okay, direct East Texas, Victor 29 to Pottstown, then direct 67 X-ray. 67 X-ray, read back, correct. The name is 67 X-ray, it's 718, 4000. Got it, 4000, 67 X-ray. Now you can really see it. The name is 67 X-ray, traffic, 12 o'clock, 6 miles, uh, maneuvering right over the ridge, primary target only, possibly gliders. Okay, we'll keep our eyes peeled, 6 x ray And the 6 7 x ray previous call traffic, no longer observed. He was to your 1 o'clock, 3 miles westbound. He just dropped off radar. Uh, 6 7 x ray Roger. I knew you never had an altitude on him, right? Negative. It was a primary target only. 6 7 x ray Roger. For 717 Victor Tango, no observed truck between you and Chester County, radar service terminated, keep your beacon all the way to the ground, change the advisory is approved. For 285 Delta, traffic now 11 o'clock and 3 miles, 2200, type unknown. 285 Delta, we still don't have it. Fully approach, Panasa 6267 X-ray, leveling 4000. 67 X-ray, fully approach, uh, proceed direct Brandywine, plan a visual approach, and uh, fully out, similar 2994. 994, direct Brandywine for the visual. 67 X ray descend, uh, maintain 2200. 2200, 67 X ray. 67 X ray, I'm not sure if you want to set up, if you're setting up for 27, but if you want to take 10 to the left, set up for the base, that's fine with me. Uh, 67 X ray, we'll just go straight for the airport and over for the field. Okay. 2994, standing by for the squawk, one way. 627 X ray, the light sports, 1 o'clock, or 1 to 2 o'clock, and about 4 miles southbound, 2300. Airport, 12 o'clock, and 10 miles. 67 X ray, uh, we can go ahead and cancel that for at this time. 67 X ray, cancel H for C's, just stay on your spoke all the way to the ground. Radar service terminated, change advisory. Uh, just keep an eye out for the lights for you twice as fast. Yeah, we'll look out for him and we'll keep the spoke all the way to the ground. 67 X ray, thanks, Jeff. Yeah. I can watch him. Okay. Pretty fast. Radar traffic, Panasa 67 X ray, turning left, base 2 side of anyone. 